as long as the red light is shining. It's good. Is it recording? Yeah. King Jake and his team have arrived at King Loco's castle. At the gates, they will call to him to speak to them. He finds that the queen was not kidnapped, but chose to go with King Loco. She was a whistleblower and shared Berg's issues with King Loco. He tells Jake that he did not treat her with proper respect. King Jake, I left willingly because I could not resist King Loco's charm and because you did not treat me with respect. But now I see that you want me and that you would do anything to have me back. I just want to be appointed as the chief marketing officer. Queen Taylor, it was a mistake to not pay attention and respect you as a vital aspect of our group. But I'm here to win you back and ask King Loco for some help. Loco, I know your kingdom is protected by the mountains, but a dragon has taken up residency in it. I'm here to come not as an enemy, but as a fellow ruler. I will help in ridding of the dragon under the mountain that threatens your kingdom in exchange for your cooperation in helping my kingdom financially. We can establish a comfortable working relationship. I will share my information on battle strategies to take down the dragon. I see that you will provide my kingdom with the defense it needs from the dragon. I will accept your terms, and our nations will become business partners. I will also use my miners to teach your people how to mine the materials from the mountain, and we will go into a business building, walls for our allied kingdoms, making our kingdoms the strongest in the land so no one can compete with us. The kings have made an agreement and plan to collaborate in defeating the dragon and building a future working relationship. The queen has also decided to come back to Berg and begin their plans to defeat the dragon. Stay tuned for next time.